What do you think? All right, right here? Yep, go for it. All right, hi everybody. This is Matt Hickey with Bailey and Parlay here at Iowa Speedway. Back to back weeks doing food reviews. Um, thank you so much for following along on our podcast and all our social medias. Thanks again to Grinding Coffee for sponsoring the episode this week. Check out the episode description for a promo code for some of their great coffee products. We really appreciate their support. Thanks to my mom for filming. Uh, David Lighting, I'm trying not to replace you, but you might be out of a job here. Tough story, Iowa Speedway. We have three food options. I mean, I get it, pandemic, there's gonna be 5,000 people here or so, so kind of makes sense that they scaled down the menu. So the goal this week is to eat items that I might come across in the future to compare them to, because again, options are hot dog, chicken strips and fries, or burger and fries. So we're getting very basic this week. I do apologize. I'm just trying to work with what I got here. I can try a king size candy bar. I'm not really sure how that's gonna go, but got the basic hot dog. Uh, I did get some grief last week about the double brat sandwich according uh, from the camera woman herself here too. I don't edit these items. I don't add ketchup or nothing. I just eat them as is. So whatever they give me is how I'm gonna eat them. So no ketchup, mustard, nothing on this hot dog. Uh, for those who didn't watch last week, I'm gonna eat it, take those bites. Give it a rating on a one to scale, one to ten, and then I'm going to compare it to an IndyCar driver in some sort of way. Uh, might be a struggle on comparisons. I mean, it's a hot dog, so if you want to get a, a good look at that, I mean, uh, all right, this is outside turns one and two. I forgot the name. It's some cheesy. I'll get the name next time, but it's some cheesy place. It used to be a Culver's, which would have been ten times better. So yeah, here we go. We're gonna dabble on this and. Uh, I don't know, I think an Oscar Mayer microwaved in my microwave probably would have been better. I'm not too sure. Um, feeling about a 3.7 on that one. And driver comparison, I'm gonna go with, uh, just because it's fresh in my head from our podcast, I'm gonna say uh, James Jakes. Very plain, not, for, not the first thing you would pick and not very good, unfortunately, but uh, We'll do more of these. Uh, well, I don't know how many more we'll do this weekend. But again, I really appreciate you guys watching and your support. Thank you so much, and we'll see you around.